Hello guys, this is RxM. I'm um, doing a follow-up on one of my uh, videos that I posted a week ago about the PS3. Yes. And uh, today I'm going to show you how to upgrade the firmware uh, just using your Windows PC and the, uh, and the Flip software. Alright. So basically what you need is your uh, PS3. Yes. Okay, and we go over here. And go to my desktop, and you're going to need this software right here. It's called Amtel, okay, which is Flip. You could you could just Google it. Double click. That should open up a screen. Okay. So what you want to do now is, while that's open, okay, you go back here, you plug in your device, one second, just make sure that it's the right, okay, so it's, so it's this way, it's upside down, okay, now you're going to hear that, you're going to get that saying malfunction, but don't worry folks, just give it about 20 seconds or so, and right now it's, it shows as red so wait till that turns to red and blue okay this will turn to red and blue okay now it's red and blue okay now when you hear that other beep okay when you hear that other beep that means it recognizes the device but I just want to warn you guys before it actually needs to recognize if you're running Windows XP on it what you need to do once you install this the software okay and the first time you want to upgrade your uh, hex file on the on the ps3s what you guys need to do when it's asking for the driver you need to point to the path of this software okay and I believe it's under the flip backslash or forward slash USB and over there you'll have like two folders I think it's XP and two and Windows 2000 so just click on USB click OK and that will install the correct driver for it okay but in the meantime so once it recognizes it and if you go back to your computer you go to manage okay you go to device manager okay and you could see right up there there it is okay you can see it there's your device all right so now okay we're gonna upgrade this okay so what you do here is you select this first icon which is your uh, chip select the target device okay and that should give you the right there 8990 USB 162 you hit okay all right then your second choice would be is click this one right here select the communication medium okay and you select you must select USB then it's gonna give you USB port connection you click open okay so automatically this will fill in everything erase leave this make sure this is not checked program checked and verify check now the next thing you want to do is go to file load hex file okay once you click on that okay now I have all of my information stored on my uh, little uh, USB uh, 2 gigabyte right there. So you just point to your hex, which I have one right there. Okay, you highlight it, you click OK. Now it loads it. Okay, it loads into the buffer information, and there it is. You hex file. PS3S Herms version 4 hex. Okay, now right from here, you just click run. Okay and then it will run it okay because I don't need to run it again because I already did it on mine and that's all you need to do and then once you're done you just close this and you just uh, you just disconnect it okay let me just uh, okay and uh, let's uh, and you just uh, let me just shut this off Okay, 
So what you want to do? You just plug it in. Okay, make sure this is unplugged. Sh shut the unit from behind. Turn it on. Press power and eject immediately. And uh, watch it load up. You see it's turning red. And right there, once that turns blue, you're in uh, you're in that mode, and it's running. And your PS3 should load up. And there you have it. There's the apps homes game, and there's the install package, and there's my manager. There you have it. Okay. That's how you upgrade your PS3S. Okay. Any questions, suggestions, comments? Go ahead. Feel free to leave. Um, I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.